Hey, it's Madeline with Bloom Birth Services, and today I want to talk to you about why moving during labor and upright birthing positions are just going to rock your birth. And so, here is a typical female pelvis. This is typical. Um, it's universal, so it, some women's pelvises might be bigger, some might be smaller. But a typical woman's pelvis is 5 inches this way, maybe 5, 5.1, 5.3, and 4.3 to 4.7 inches this way, so not quite 5 inches this way. So a typical woman's pelvis. Baby's going to want to come out here, and what they do is they do a cardinal movement, and they come out. And so that's why the space here is so important to be able to move. So when you are in an upright moving position, you're allowing your sacrum and your coccyx to move. And so what does an upright moving position look like? So squatting, sitting, being in a standing position, hips wide and open. What does that do for you? That allows 30% more space. And so that allows this little tailbone to move typically around one and a half inches. So if you're thinking of a baby's head coming through there, that is a really great space to have that to move. So when you're laying down on a bed and your hips and your pelvis and that sacrum is not allowed to move, you're really kind of inhibiting what your body wants to do. So if we can get you in an upright position, squatting, sitting, birth ball, peanut ball, or a cub, cub seat, that's going to just allow your body to move and work with your baby so that it can come out in a little bit better position and a faster manner. So that's what I love about the cub seat is the cub seat allows you to use many different positions. So we have sitting, we have kneeling, we have laying down with a partner and this just allows you to rest or be able to use gravity and let your belly hang a little bit. But great thing is, is even if you are on a bed with an epidural, you can still use this seat to allow your hips to be open and that sacrum to move. So if you're really wanting an upright birth, I would highly suggest looking into a cub seat or just getting, being aware and um, knowing your options about what you can do to help that sacrum and coccyx move and baby come out. Happy birthing!